We are learning more tonight about a lawsuit against a former tennis coach at Idaho State University. A tennis player is suing the coach and the university for discrimination because of his religion. Warren Duffin is LDS. He says he was harassed and verbally abused by his, ch his coach and teammates during last year's tennis matches. An investigation was conducted by the university last year and is now in the hands of Duffin's attorneys. Eyewitness News reporter Angelina Dixon is covering this story for us. Attorneys have 120 days to serve ISU with the complaint. After that, the case may begin at the federal court. From the very beginning, tennis player Oren Duffin started his fall semester at ISU in 2014. According to court records, a timeline of harassment and discrimination didn't begin until December of 2014. He claims he felt he was being treated differently from the other players and was being overly criticized of his play. In March of 2015, the team went to Las Vegas for a tournament. It was there that Duffin claimed his coach and team members purposely ordered prostitutes or strippers to his hotel room. Duffin claims it was to test convictions of his Mormon faith. According to court records, he turned the girls away. In April of 2015, the team went to a tournament in Sacramento, where he claims the coach, Bobby Goltz, harassed Duffin for not playing while he was injured. In April, he filed a report to the ISU Athletic Office, which began the investigation. ISU was unable to comment during this pending litigation, but as it's still in progress, court records state that Duffin is suing ISU for verbal abuse, hostile behavior, ridiculing, and more. In the meantime, he is on a mission and told his attorney he refuses to rejoin the tennis team when he gets back. In Pocatello, I'm Angelina Dixon. Tennis coach Bobby Goltz uh, resigned back in July of last year.